Hi Virgo, welcome to your reading and this is your April the 2nd to April the 3rd of 2020. This is for Virgo Ascendant, Moon Rising and Venus Placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. No cross watchers. If you showed up in this reading and I am not the one that was, I mean, and you are not the one that I am describing, then it is not you. All right. I don't know you personally, so I don't have any means of attacking anybody. And I don't have any, I don't have any att intention of attacking anybody because again, we don't know each other personally but i am just reading a card and that shows okay you know yourself better make a better judgment if that is you now if you feel that that's not you then don't fit yourself into other person's um identity okay so if um if you resonate with this please uh i mean congratulations this is for Leo, right? Leo. Okay. I need to check it. Leo. <clears throat> so, Leo, if you resonate with this, then congratulations. If you do not resonate with this, then you can go back to this reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. Or you can check your placements reading. All right? So Leo, let's start with the reading. The Moon card and Five of Swords. There's an energy fight here. And you were enlightened. No. I'm too good for this fight. I want to get out of this fight and... You're going to choose your battle moving forward. And this one is not the battle that you have to be in. You're seeing things in a different perspective now. You are enlightened. You might be connecting with a Pisces or has a Pisces connection. I mean placement on their chart. Or you have a Pisces placement on their chart. Knight of Pentacles. <clears throat> Someone here will approach you. Is this a peace offering? Something tangible. Something that you will feel, taste, smell, touch. Okay? But I think you're not going to accept it. You're not going to accept the apology if this is an apology. You're going to find your happiness here okay or it could be them okay you can switch the energy okay someone here will leave this connection even though that there is love and i think this is the battle that the battle that i am referring to you're gonna put an end into this battle <clears throat> the hermit this battle has been going on for quite a while now you're enlightened already I, you don't need this no more king of wands and ace of wands you're gonna find your own passion here um, whether it is job career finances or just enjoying yourself <laughs> enjoying yourself this is a phallic card i think it is you're gonna also feel that it's much better to enjoy yourself in so many ways all right um why i'm not sure i don't want to go there but either way you're gonna enjoy yourself in all shapes and form four of swords <clears throat> since you've been through to this kind of situation now every person that who will approach you you're gonna be a little defensive here trust issue could be well you cannot blame a person if 
you know, a person was um I mean went through a lot. Um I believe that I heard or you see or read this quote, I'm not sure. It's been a while now. Um every every evil queen was once a princess that was never saved. Eight of Swords someone here is stressed, someone here I think also if this is you, you put yourself into this situation. Yep. This is a self inflicted prison. You put yourself well, in the first place you allowed this, right? I mean, I've, I've got to be a real talker here. You allowed this, the person get comfortable, and now it's become a responsibility that you have to do things for them. You made them privileged. My apologies. That's not an attack. That's for someone to wake up. Can okay, again, you know yourself better. If I am not the one, if if you are not like, if you are not this and you're not the one that I'm describing with, okay, don't fit yourself into this. But for someone who will relate to this, here, let's clarify. It's because that you have a huge amount of love. Are you juggling to make an end on this? And still continue. It's here. It's here. Um, Leo. Are you sure you're a Leo? I'm not sure. With this, um, a Scorpio card. You might be connecting with a Scorpio or has a Scorpio placement on their chart. Pisces again showed up. I think you are caught also in between your two placements Mars and Venus right aggressiveness and submissiveness there's a fight within yourself it's here there's a fight within yourself If you want to go in-depth with this reading, you can book a personal reading with me. You can contact me at babaylantv at gmail.com. If you resonate with this, click the subscribe button, smash that notification bell, and comment down below. I'm very interactive. Thank you so much, Leo, for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. Goodbye.